I try and keep my fishing tactically as simple as I can, but I do put a lot of effort into my baits. And I'm gonna show you three edges now that will really boost your baits for the colder months, whether you're fishing for roach, carp, barbel, chub, whatever, these are all gonna catch you more fish. So I'm gonna take you through them now. First of all, maggots. Pint of maggots here. First thing I'll do, riddle them off. Riddle anything off, any maize flour. Back in. Nice clean maggots. Two additives that I swear by. First one is turmeric. I go in nice and generous with a turmeric. It's a nice sort of subtle smelling spice. Been using it years. Second one, and this is no plug at all. Some match anglers will probably not thank me for showing, but this feed stim XT powder on your maggots makes a big difference. Roach, love it. I'll go in with a good, on a pint of maggot, probably a tablespoon. Shake it up. I'll do this the uh, day before as well, so those maggots actually start to draw those flavours into them, and that's it. Boosted maggots done. The second edge, sweet corn, jolly green giant. It's brilliant straight out of the can, but in winter, I like to be different, I like to boost it up, and I like it spicy. When I was at Spa Shop all those years ago, studying sort of fish science and fish feeding behaviour, I learned very quickly how much, particularly carp, like spice. So we've got two cans in there, and then we've got hot chilli powder, not mild curry powder, none of that, the hot one, the one you put on your tongue and it burns. A good dose of this, like a really good dose. There we go probably like half a tablespoon. Lastly, some old school red dye. Anything out of the supermarket would do. Just a little, you don't need lots of this. I left the liquid in as well as you, I didn't drain the liquid off. One more thing, some extra salt, rock salt. So chili, red dye, rock salt. Give it a really good shake. I like to, again, this is one you want to do the night before. Keep it in the fridge. And look at that. That's probably one of the best winter carp baits you can use. The third tip, an absolute deadly bait for chub, barbel and carp. Spam, probably one of my favourite baits. You see it a lot with me out of the tin. I'm going to chuck, cut it up. You can tear it. I'm just going to quickly cut it quite big chunks. I can always make them smaller, but I can't make them bigger. Like so. Into a freezer bag. And then simply this stuff, fish love it, all species love it, garlic, salt. I have it, when I used to make my own boilies, I used to put a lot of this in. It's a really, really good additive. A good splash of this. Let's take the cap off. I've done all the caps except that one. So yeah, a good generous dose of garlic, salt. Then just seal it up. It's all covered in that lovely salty garlic powder, but you need to freeze it. It gets better. The, the freezing process will draw all of that salt and garlic into the meat, and that's when it's at its best. So this is now going to go straight in the freezer, and I'll probably do two or three of these bags at a time. Three of my best winter bait edges I can give you, so I hope you give them a go. 
get out there and catch more fish.